So this is the last video in the series. Um, so as we started out, I just wanted to show you how to set up the layout of a website using Bootstrap. Uh, we can definitely make this better by improving the styling, the spacing, margins, and things like that. But that's not what this video is for. I just wanted to show you the layout. So don't submit this as your final work. It needs a lot of improvement. But, and at the same time, this is fully responsive as well. So you don't even have to worry about writing custom media queries. That's the beauty about, about Bootstrap. But then there are a few Bootstrap elements that I didn't get to show you guys. So I just want to go through a couple of them really quickly. And one of them is the carousel element. Obviously, these guys use the carousel over here. I didn't use it because I just wanted to go through the layout very quickly. And so if you come to the Bootstrap documentation, you go to component and you come to carousel, you can see some of the options you have for pure image, carousel, one with the controls, and an indicator, and of course, um, one with text, right? So let me quickly show you how this will work if we replace the Jumbotron with a section. So I'm going to copy this. Go in here to the Jumbo transaction. Let me separate this so that you can see what's happening. It's the Jumbo transaction. I'm going to get rid of all this and replace it with HTML for the carousel section. So copy. Now this is the carousel section. So let's see how it looks right now. So we're going to go from this to this our first slide over here. Obviously, we can see it because we haven't added images. So let me go ahead and add a couple of images. Let's say uh, images for slash. I'm going to use the sunrise image that I downloaded from the site. Okay, so now that's the sunrise image right here. That's our controls. And obviously I haven't added the rest of the images, so it's kind of acting weird. Let me add the other images. Let's say, let me add BG over here. And I'll add the sunrise image gain over here just for illustration purposes. And so there we have it. We have a full carousel. The controls are down here. You can move it around easily and you have control over it. And obviously, as mentioned earlier, it's still going to be responsive. So that's the great part. All right. Awesome. So that's it for the carousel section.